Let me show you what you can do with Mindspace by using the snap key on Oppo Find X9. So first of all, if you go to settings and scroll down, we should be able to find snap key settings. And over here, of course, we can make sure that snap to Mindspace is selected. We can also see the list of options that we have with the snap key. So for example, we can uh, tap the button once, we can just press it once in order to make it read the screen and save the content over here on the uh, on the dynamic island over here we can see that the mind space is analyzing and once the content is saved we can for example tap on it in order to uh, see it in my case i actually did it too slowly so i'm gonna just go to the mind space over here if i can only find it maybe i will have it in the home screen actually there we go and in here we have all of these different options. So for example, over here, we have the AI summary over here with the uh, hashtags and we can also find uh, some, re well, we can add remarks over here and so on and so forth. So this is what we can do. For example, we can just simply like take a screenshot and let the Mindspace uh, make a summary out of it. I also used it in the home screen before and it actually read the time, the weather and so on and so forth. So as you can see, we can probably find some um, or generate some stuff with it. And we can also ask questions um, to find out more about, probably more about the uh, taken uh, screenshot. Besides that, what you can also do is uh, we can uh, touch and hold in order to save an audio. So if you want to, you can press and hold the snap key. First, we need to select the voice input language. So I'm gonna choose English in my case, there we go. And now if you press and hold it, also, we need to grant permissions, okay? Maybe this time. There we go. Now we are actually recording a quid voice memo. So this can also be used in order to create a note with your voice, essentially. So if you don't want to type anything or something, but you want to, you know, keep in mind about something, then of course we can add that into the mind space. And we can double tap, double press the mind space in order to immediately open it. So of course, in my case, I added the mind space to the home screen, but you can double tap the button in order to immediately open the mind space as well. Now over here we have the recording, we have the transcript as well. We can tap on these three dots in order to add remarks or delete the recording. We can also play the recording, of course, if you want to. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, leave a like and subscribe.